<laughs> so, hello everyone. Hello, hello. Uh, so, I'm Chris Baker. We're still, more people are tuning in. This is Colby. I'm Colby. Um, and we're, we're doing, we're going to take some questions. A lot of the questions were about you voting for uh -huh. Trump. And I know sure. that you've spoken about it before. So, what would you want to say to people that haven't had the chance, and maybe have only heard that you voted for Trump, and nothing else since then? Is uh, there any, you know, I know that you're uh, very liberal. You're not, you're not no. like a Republican. Oh, I'm not yeah, liberal yeah, yeah. at all. I'm very, oh, oh. very far to the left. Yeah, very far. Oh, the right. problem is that liberals aren't to the left. People think that they are. So, right. So it's, it's, That's it's, the problem. So it's Democrats, liberals, and then it's, and then you're further than I'm, that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm a communist. You, you're so, a communist. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm a communist. So that explains <laughs> why, I guess people were confused maybe that you supported Trump and what he said or or whatever the Republicans don't, did to like latch on to him. What would you like to say about that? I think the problem is is that I don't support Trump. I did vote for Trump. Right. That's the distinction. While me. while you were talking politics, uh, <laughs> I was asked to do several things to your face. Oh, okay. Which porn star would you Ooh. set me up with? On a date. That's, what kind of guys do you like? Um, you have such a hot boyfriend. I don't know if there's know. a porn star that could compete. Honestly. He is very hot. Be, can you choke? Oh, okay. Well, okay. Choke the shit guys, out. let's choke keep shit. it. Let's keep it super P PG thirteen. R R. Yeah. Could we R. Do uh, are you planning to do any other countries? So Colby did America. This is our project where you went to every I state. I went to every state and in the did, U.S. Did a video. and several Canadian provinces. Okay, and several Canadian provinces. Did you go to Hawaii? I did. And Alaska. So I so did. with okay. I no. You set your sights. I would love place. to do every country in the world. I mean, the oh. problem is finding the financing. Like, pretty sure. expensive endeavor. Is there? And a I've place... kind of blown my uh, <laughs> my uh, <laughs> my You've social your, capital a lot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> so I don't know if it's possible at this point in time, but maybe, maybe in the future, people will what I've noticed, learn to forgive me. <laughs> yeah, I think people from. Since the show has come out and the episodes you've been in and, you know, the more the people have watched my show, I have noticed that there's a, still a ton of love out there for you. Yeah. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't be, you know. Chris, I just noticed you kind of look like Brandon Urie. I don't that? know who that is. Google. I hope Research. that's a compliment. To, I'm sure it is. You're beautiful, Chris. Both, oh, thank you so much, Colin. No one can compete with you. Is the air conditioning on? It doesn't feel like it is. This okay. Is, this is we're Texas. okay. <laughs> it is, oh, it is. Oh, yeah. We're in Austin, Texas. How hot is it right Ooh. now? It's probably 110 it's degrees. It, I mean, and it's it like 100. Nights. Yeah. Yeah. It is. And so humid. <sighs> the worst. Yeah, it's pretty bad. My hair gets all curly. I can't do it. Your, well, your hair seems like it's fine in any climate. It flattens out. When I'm in Arizona, it like poofs out. I like that. I like poopy. That's, that's adorable. We have a question from Daniel Uli Barry. Colby, hey, Daniel. it's your Costa Rican buddy. I think you guys must know each other. Hi, Daniel. Uh, I'd like to see more of you in high maintenance. Got your eye on any other roles? Did great, man. I would love to do another one. I was actually in New York uh, a couple of weeks ago, and I ran into one of the, the whole... Yeah. No, one of the, oh, the high maintenance. works for HBO. Okay. And they're like, oh, we'll see if we can get you on an episode. But, you know, I think it's difficult because it would be uh, challenging to, like, reprise that role that I played. Because all of them are, like, one. If, and if anybody yeah. doesn't know, so there's an HBO show called High Maintenance, which I saw you on, which made me think that you would be great for my show. Because um, I, I obviously had only seen certain things that you had done, but not your acting ability. <laughs> and you were really great. Uh, but it was like it was a self-contained narrative. Yeah. Right. So so we don't know if and that I play a certain character, so I don't know if it makes sense to like right. bring that character back. Yeah. Did you and Bob the drag queen meet? I have personally never met Bob the drag queen. Have you met Bob? Before? I Bob is brilliant. I think he's brilliant. so funny. And he, such he was a the winner art. last year. Yeah. Oh my great. god, such a talent. He's really really. He's a real New York queen. I like that. Yeah, Very I have good so style. much respect for Bob. Very funny. A lot of attitude. Love that. My God. I, we got a question about uh, my return to music, so I have to address that. I sang. I don't know about Back this. in the day. Yeah, I was a pop star. Oh, my God. 10 million views on YouTube. It's okay. 
It's okay. We'll say you sing also, something now. Also, Sarah no. <laughs> um, I was you, just on if a, you sing for me, I'll a, take my shirt off. <laughs> you would take your shirt off anyway. <laughs> I I do plan to come back to music. The show has kind of like took taken over my life, mm. and that's that's pretty intense. So all of the work with the show, working on new episodes, everything that's coming for that is happening. So I haven't had time totally to do music, but I do plan to come back. Do you want to be uh, a music video ho? Do you know what music those are? Music video ho? <laughs> I don't know. Oh. Yeah, like rappers when they have like all those girls in little oh, bikinis. I don't want to be, be the ho. I want to be the rapper. I want like butts in my face. Is will you do me an adequate question? Will you no. do me? <laughs> when you smile, it's so fucking cute. I, I think that was addressed probably to you. No, you have a much better smile. Oh, stop. I did a whitening strip on the flight over. Did you really? No. Let me see this too. Is the acting slash being directed process much different from that of porn films? <sighs> like from, from what you did on my show. I have to say, Colby was incredibly professional on set. Aww. He showed up on time. He knew his lines. You really did. You did knew, I? He, he, knew, he knew the lines that like I didn't know and I wrote the thing. So, so for us, like working on our show, it was like a dream. How is it for you and how is it different from being on uh, The Probably the biggest difference is there's a lot of crew members on what we did oh, compared right. to a, a typical. We person. were like 10 or 12 people probably, like, you yeah, know, with everyone. Yeah. And I've, like, I've done my share of porn films that require more acting or, right. you know, at least a giving a line. <laughs> but, like, typically it's like there's not a lot. They don't care, like, how you deliver it. Right. So... So then there's no, so like you're never redirected for the non-porn Sometimes. I used to work with Joe Gage. He's kind of like a well-known, like classic porn director. Okay. And uh, we did like Kansas City Trucking Company. It's very well-known porn porn videos. Something to look for. And most of those videos were actually acting. The sex part was like a very small part of what we did. And he he was very specific. Like if you had to deliver the line exactly as it was written, right? And he had like you know he'd give you he'd give you notes. Oh wow! Okay, yeah, that's more than what we did. Yeah. <laughs> we were just kind of like, yeah, that that's funny. Yeah, I feel like what I did with you is harder. Really? Yeah. Well, I was just like I was just improvising a lot with you. So like whenever you would give me the line that I wrote for you, I would just give you something different every time. So maybe that was like keeping you on your feet. Yeah. Well, and there's like toes. a comedy component, and I'm not. Yeah. I don't know how funny. But you were the straight, like yeah, you, you were the straight, straight man, yeah. while I was the crazy. Greetings from Argentina. Hello, Ooh, Argentina. Argentina. I love- what is your other background? Is it all Ukrainian? Uh, it's Lemko and different groups who came from that area, okay. and then on my dad's side, and then my mother's side, it's like German and Swiss and. Oh, you know, cool. Scotch Irish, I think. Nice. Yeah, I'm just, That's what I am. I'm a mutt. I'm a mutt too. I'm half Italian uh-huh. and a quarter German. Okay. And then one eighth British and one eighth Scottish. I can see all of those in your face. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good combination. You're just saying. It that. worked out well. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, you watch you watch Rick and Morty. I do watch Rick and Morty. What else? What other TV do you watch? Uh oh man. I actually don't watch a lot of TV. I don't have we have a TV, but it's not hooked up anything okay so like we'll watch movies occasionally but honestly like i've been maybe a little too addicted to rick and morty no no new, the news oh god uh, yeah i need a problem from that. favorite episode of rick and morty uh the one where they go to the like feminist planet <laughs> that one is so good that is a really good one. it's a good one Uh-oh. baker what porn studio would you work for oh well i i do enjoy men.com Every now and then. And, uh, but Cocky Boys, I think, would be kind of fun. Cocky yeah. Boys? Yeah. They're here. I can hook you up. Oh. I can get you a gig. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Colby, do you like it where you live? I love it where I live. I do. It's incredible. It's beautiful. I wish I could, like, show you pictures. It's amazing. Chris, would you like to be a contestant on The Voice? In case you say yes, which coach would you love to collaborate with? Would love to be on The Voice. And of the coaches that are now, I would say Gwen Stefani because she is, like... Good pick. She's the best. She's so fucking cool. And I love... I want to know what she does to her skin. I'm... I'm... I'm I'm obsessed. Baby. Okay. (laughs) Favorite Drag Race winner? I would have to say Bianca Del Rio. 
I think she's the funniest. Bianca is good. I did a scene, a porn scene with Bianca. Really? Yeah. What was yeah. that? I did it for men.com. She won an award, I think, actually, for it. What award was she winning? I don't know. For... She wasn't having cover. sex. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Which scene is your favorite or stands out? The one, uh, the one, so no, the one in high maintenance. Yeah. Oh, no. Not the one no, either. the one we did. Oh, my God. The one we did. The one we did. Which you will see a lot more of on Wednesday. Sorry, we're doing this because the finale of Baker Daily is this Wednesday morning. What's your favorite song that you've done? Uh, my favorite song that I have recorded is a song called Echo, Echo. which is on my YouTube page. I don't know. It was one of the first songs you I can't did. Can't hum a few bars. No. No. Please. No. But they. But we gotta get it. We gotta get them to watch. I need. I need the views. I need all the views. No. Actually, can I tell them why I'm here? And is that oh yeah, of course. Salacious? Yeah. I am a flesh jack boy. <laughs> he, he's a flesh jack boy. So coming soon to a sex store near you <laughs> will be a lady named Jasmine. <laughs> really? <laughs> That's a secret. That's okay. a secret. That's the Can't secret name that. of my penis. <laughs> oh, excuse me. We found yeah. something new today. Yeah. Colby has a name for his penis, and it's Jasmine. A lady named Jasmine. A lady named Jasmine. Lady oh, that's the full Jasmine. title. A full title. She a lady a named lady. Jasmine. She sounds been, like a whore. She's, yeah. Why are you taller than me right now, by the way? I, I'm going to sit on a book. Oh, that, that sounds fun. I'm leaning over this way to <laughs> get... There we go. I'm saying, okay. Yeah, there we okay. go. Okay. So this feels good. Sit down. So how long has this taken? Can you talk about what you did today? Um, yeah, I had the mold actually made today. They did a scan. They didn't do an, a mold. Okay. So I shouldn't call it a mold. They so did it's a, scan. 3D, it's a 3D scan, scan. <laughs> of your yeah. penis. And I can say this. I'm very proud to announce okay. that I was the first one to do a 3D scan of my butthole. I will be the first 3D scan butthole. Colby <laughs> Keller <laughs> making Jack. history. Making history. No. Do you have a favorite song? I have a favorite song. Yes. Right now. It is uh, Dua Lipa. Uh, she's my favorite. I don't know. Favorite. I don't know. I'm like, uh, I live in a cave. I don't know. <laughs> you know, like, guys, Colby actually literally lives in a cave. I do live in a cave. Like, after, <laughs> in after Arizona, he yeah. literally lives in a cave. <laughs> yeah, I do. Um, no, uh, Dua Lipa, New Rules. Okay. And it is it the best song ever. Really? It's so good. Yes. Okay. So that's my favorite song right now. Right now. And the new J Lo song, because J Lo, I, I could I could talk about J Lo ever. Always. Uh, but the new Spanish single that she released, it's all Spanish. It's oh, very good. cool. Yeah. Nice. Mm -hmm. Do you have any shows that you would want to act on? That was one of the questions we got too. Oh, um, like are there, are there any shows that you've seen? I know you don't watch I a lot do, of TV. I but do. If there are, oh, have you? Yeah. My problem is, is that my brain oftentimes doesn't work. What's the one? The show? It's a British show, and it's like sci-fi, black something. Battlestar Galactica. No, no, no. It's oh, like, Orphan Black. No, no, no. 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 It's like each episode. <laughs> it's like a best. different. Oh, Black Mirror. Black Mirror. I want to be on Black Mirror. Because <laughs> then it would only be one episode, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. It, you know? It's perfect for He's me. very good. He's very good at I'm like very making good at, cameos. Yes, exactly. On I want to amazing the cameo television king. shows. That's, my, that's yeah. my life. I really like your shirt. Do you like my shirt? I do, yeah. I like do you it. want to switch? Sure. All right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Here oh, you go. God, look at that. Ah! <laughs> this may oh, not this is... fit me, though. I think it could be kind of tight. I think it's gonna be really tight, but I like it tight. Mm. Oh, this is huge. Yeah, too big. But this is fun. Yeah. I can wear this. Good colors. There we go. Look at that. I look. Looks how handsome I look in this shirt. See, I knew that. <laughs> but your arms are so much bigger than mine. You're like making it look so much better. You can maybe you can make this into a tank top. <laughs> I should make it into. <laughs> yeah. I should just chop this shirt off. Yeah, because you'll, be you'll never wear it again. <laughs> no, I, I won't. Sorry. But thank you very much. Thank for you for having this. me. I really of appreciate it. Of course. Uh, we're gonna sign off here in uh, Austin, Texas. Beautiful. Good Austin, to have Texas. you all with us. And uh, season finale of Baker Daily yes. this Wednesday. Wednesday. He and I do some crazy things uh, in the very beginning of the episode. You really will not want to miss it. And I get Trump impeached, and you have to find out how. So tune in. <laughs>